across to the cenotaph, noting the Metropole Hotel on the right. Blackpool's War Memorial is Grade 2 listed and located next to the North Pier. Following the First World War, a small temporary obelisk was inscribed, The Blood of Heroes is the Seed of Freedom. That memorial was replaced by a current 27 metre tall granite obelisk designed by Ernest Prestwich. The memorial was built at a cost of £17,000 and was raised by public subscription. The memorial was unveiled by Brigadier General T.E. Topping on the 10th of November 1923. The east and west sides bear bronze panels representing the different units of the armed forces. The names of the fallen are engraved on the three chest tombs standing on the platform holding the obelisk. The main memorial was restored in 2007 to 2008 and a new memorial was created to the memory of those killed in non-competitive roles. Blackpool's history of hospitality starts right here at the Grand Metropole Hotel. The building was originally the Bailey's Hotel, which was one of Blackpool's earliest. Bailey's is mentioned in the first book describing Blackpool by W. Hutton in 1788. During its early life, Bailey's had 34 rooms for guests, but it was altered and enlarged several times, so that it had doubled its size by 1900. The building contains elegant public rooms with many original features, like the Regency Lounge. Nicknamed the Honeymoon Hotel in the 1930s, it was owned for many years by Butlins, 